I am Gabriel, who stands before God. I was sent to speak to you and to announce to you this good news. Luke 1.19 The name Gabriel means the power of God, fortitudo dei in Latin, or God has shown himself mighty. St. Gabriel appears in Scripture in several places. In the Old Testament, he explains the vision of the horned ram to Daniel, Daniel 8, and announced to him the prophecy of the 70 weeks in Daniel 9. In the New Testament, he appeared to Zechariah to announce the birth of John the Baptist, and then again to announce to the Blessed Virgin Mary that she had been chosen to bear the Messiah, the Son of God. Isn't it interesting that his name means the power of God, when his main job was to announce the Incarnation? This babe in the manger who seemed so helpless, this Jesus who would let himself be tortured and crucified. Um, but St. Paul was right. You know, this Christ and his cross, they are the power of God. They are the wisdom of God. And it reminds me of the fact that when my... One of my former spiritual directors had first become a priest. They sent him to witness a public exorcism. And in this cathedral full of people that were possessed and people holding them down, as the exorcist went through the litany of the saints as part of the exorcism, he expected that when they got to St. Michael, the archangel, that the demons would just freak out. But they didn't. It was when they got to the name of St. Gabriel. That's when the demons really freaked out and went crazy. And it is really interesting because this power of God, his great humility, his love, and his omnipotence shows through this incarnation, which was the great thing that they rejected. They rejected Our Lady and having to serve Our Lady in her nature being so far below them and yet glorified and raised up by grace to be so far above them in their pride they couldn't handle it in their pride they couldn't take the incarnation but this is the power of god the babe in the manger i love it but because he is this great messenger which is actually the word that we get angel from is agalos in greek which actually means messenger but he is this great messenger of the incarnation and therefore he is the patron saint of messengers postal workers and radio and television workers who bring us messages in the old calendar his feast is celebrated on march 24th in the new calendar he's celebrated on september 29th along with saints michael and raphael so here is this beautiful prayer to St. Gabriel. I'll give it to you both in English and Latin here. First in English. O strength of God, St. Gabriel, you who announced to the Virgin Mary the incarnation of the only begotten Son of God, I praise and honor you, O elect spirit, and I humbly beg you to be my advocate before Jesus Christ our Savior and his Blessed Mother. I also pray that you might be willing to comfort and strengthen me in all my difficulties, lest at any time, overcome by temptation, I offend my God by sin. Amen. Now in the original Latin. O fortitudo Dei, Sancte Gabriel, qui Virgini Maria Incarnationem Unigeniti Filii Dei Annunciasti, laudo et veneror te, o electe Spiritus, et supplexoro, ut meus apud Jesum Christum Salvatorem nostrum, et eius benedictam matrem advocatus esse, atque in omnibus angustiis me solari et corroborare velis, ne ullis unquam tentationibus superatus, deum meum peccato offendam. Amen. Well, I hope you've found this video helpful. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. And make sure you're subscribed, and feel free to leave me a comment. I'd love to hear from you. God bless, et oremus pro invicem.